YouTube, we're back with another video. Um, we're about to go pick up these 13s that just dropped today. Today I'm gonna be wearing my Chicago's though. One thing I really don't like about 13s though is this tongue is all the way up here. If you have short and stubby legs, you're, it's gonna look like you got shin guards. If you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button. It helps me, it motivates me to make new videos, especially right now guys, because I've been feeling kind of sick lately. So hopefully today picking these shoes up takes everything off my mind and you know, just uh, kind of makes me feel a little bit better. But anyway, man, let's go. Let's go uh, take off and let's go pick these things up. So we're here at Hibbits. We're about to pick these things up. And you guys can let me know uh, what you guys think about them. See if you guys picked yours up today. I know a lot of these things are sitting. I don't even know if somebody already picked up my pair or not because it's after the reservation time. So we'll see if they still got them. If they still got them, we'll do all this. Let's go check it out, man. Huh? Last time I came, guys, um, I picked up my lightnings and the lady got kind of like weirded out because we had the camera and they're not used to it. But yeah, let's go in there, see what's good. Make sure you guys subscribe. I want to say thank you to everybody that's been subscribed to the channel. Um, I appreciate you guys, everybody that leaves comments. Thank you so much. Uh, I enjoy you guys watching the channel and you know, just growing, man. Hopefully we hit 2K here soon. I want to do a little giveaway once we hit 2K. You must have sold it to the white boy. I say you must have sold it to the boy. Thank you. Thank you. Do you guys still have the size size for It's really low. Do you guys still have a lot of pairs that people didn't pick up? Or? Yeah. Yeah. Alright guys, we're back. Uh, whew, well, it was like a 45 minute drive. Um, shout out to the Hibbits in Dodge City, Kansas. Uh, we did not get them here in my city, which we do have a Hibbits here, but we didn't get them here uh, in Garden City. Um, usually I would have picked them up here, but it just depends where you win your raffles. But as far as this release, it's weird. We didn't get them at this store, but we got them at another store. Hopefully that doesn't mean that we're losing like our retros or because that'd be super sad. Um, man, then I'm really gonna be desperate driving 45 minutes just to pick up a pair of shoes. Uh, but anyway, man, make sure you guys hit the like button. Let me know if you guys did pick these things up. Um, and just let me know what, you're, what, what you like about them. The reason why I picked these up is because I had the He Got Games. I picked them up uh, back when was it 2018 when they released or 2019, I don't even remember. Um, but anyway, I had them and I sold them and I really regretted it. So um, this one's just kind of like the He Got Games. Let me go over home real quick, I guess. Let's check these things out. Air Jordan 13 Retro, $190 is the retail. White, uh, dark, powder blue. So obviously it's the Air Jordan 13 Obsidians. Um, that's what they're called, the Obsidians. Um, and let's open these things up. And I did get them from Hibbits, like I said. I paid $173, you guys saw obviously that I picked them up from there. Um, I used my uh, my reward. You guys know that Hibbits, Hibbits is honestly one of like the best places to pick up your shoes because they reward the customers for for buying uh, their merchandise and just uh, if you want to you know buy your kids some clothes and stuff like that and just build up points for the next release so you could use it towards your uh, pickups. You know it, it just keeps the company in, in business and it keeps them moving their apparels and uh, all that stuff. So that's the good thing about Hibbit Sports and the rewards program. Um, so I did pick these up for 170 bucks. I had a $30 rewards that I used. So that's just a plus on Hibbit Sports, um, why you guys should shop with them. Uh, here we do have the obsidians here and I'm going to kind of review them, just let you guys know what you guys are going to, uh, what you guys can expect. This is a true to size sneaker. So I would say go true to size. Um, I am wearing my Chicago's right now. I don't know if you guys could see them. Oh, there you guys see them right there. But anyway, you guys saw them at the beginning of the video. I was wearing my Chicago's and I go true to size. It's 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 a cool shoe. And the reason why I like the 13 model is because they don't crease as bad at all since they already got this stitch in here. Let me show you guys. They already got that stitching on the toe cap and you, you guys see all this stitching going on through the toe cap. So that kind of helps out a lot uh, with the creasing. So you're not gonna get as much creases. You got your Jordan, uh, of course, right here above the toe cap. And then you got the 
uh, Roman numerals in the back, you know, 13, Jordan 13. And you're gonna have the, and it's crazy, I thought people were gonna go crazy over these. I don't know what the camera's picking up or why it's, the camera's just moving around. Hold on, okay, there we go. So, I thought these were gonna go crazy because they got like that powder blue, and you guys know anything that's powder blue or UNC flies off the shelves, but no, these are actually sitting. Um, and to give you guys my best advice, I would really tell you guys just, uh, you know, just maybe just hold off, you know, um, if you guys want to wait, maybe you guys could get them for a lower price. If you guys do have an outlet around you guys, I would say maybe uh, uh, check your outlets and see if uh, you guys could find them at an outlet for a cheaper price. I know they made B grades on these. I think I watched a, a review, I think shout out to Ballin' on a budget, he did a review where he found these early sitting at outlets. So I know that there's B grades floating around. But yeah, the also is really nice. You know, it's got that panther paw. Um, it resembles a panther, the black panther, uh, the black cat. If you guys did not know, this is supposed to be like, you know, the cat right there. The the eyes are the holograms. Um, but yeah, sorry for the bad lighting, guys. I just wanted to bring you guys a quick review. Very, very nice shoe. Um, I like the color pattern. Um, like I said, it resembles the He Got Games by a lot. Um, if you swap out the the powder blue for you know the red, you're gonna have the He Got Games. Um, but yeah, let me know what you guys think about the shoe. I hope you guys enjoyed the little mini vlog, uh, picking up the sneakers and all that. We're gonna throw these on feet real quick. Uh, sub up to your boy Jay. Uh, we should be doing a giveaway at 2,000 subs. Um, and I'll try to think of what way I'm gonna do that giveaway. I already have something in mind, so make sure you guys are staying tuned, you know. Um, and yeah, let, comment down below. Let me know what your favorite part about the shoe is, or let me know if you guys passed on these. Let me know what you guys are waiting on. If you're waiting on spending your money somewhere else, maybe you, maybe you want the Yeezys that are dropping here soon. I know there's some pretty dope Yeezys. But yeah, this is a little quick review on the Air Jordan 13 Obsidian. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let's throw these on feet, and then I'll be out of here, man. On to the next review. It's your boy Jay, we're out, man. Later, saludos, hasta luego, peace.